This lesson, we are going to be creating a brand new spreadsheet and adding in some new rows of content into the sheet and then selecting that existing sheet and making updates to it. This lesson, we're going to be creating a spreadsheet and then we'll select that spreadsheet and we'll add some data to the spreadsheet and this is a custom function. So let's uh, create our spreadsheet object using the spreadsheet app and then create. And it's expecting a string value for the sheet name. So this will create the spreadsheet. And then within the logger log, we'll select and we'll add in and we'll output whatever the sheet ID is. So we'll get the ID value of the sheet and we'll output that into the log. And that's the value that we can then use in order to select the sheet and make updates to it. So we're also within the sheet. So let's uh, actually select the sheet within the spreadsheet and we'll just use the get sheets. So this is going to return back an array of the sheets and because it's going to be a new spreadsheet we'll just select the first sheet and then within the sheet itself we can use the append row and the rows are appended as an array of the column items so if we want for the row data it's going to be expecting an array and each item within the array is a different column so this will add in these values into the various columns and then we can just append the row this way within the sheet. So let's run the function and there's our ID for the sheet and we're going to need that and that ID is actually going to correspond with the ID of the new sheet that was just created. There's our sheet that was just created and there we can get the ID as well. That's the first row of content that's already been added into the first sheet. So let's uh, select the sheet, update sheet and first parameter that we need is we need the ID of the sheet in order to reference it. And once we have the ID, we can select using the spreadsheet app and then open by ID. And we specify the ID of the sheet that we want to select. And then this is going to be the same where we're able to then select the sheet that we want to work with. So we're going to be working with whatever the first sheet is with the index value of one. And then let's uh, make some updates to this content and it'll append that row of content. So let's uh, update the sheet and that's going to update the content in to the next available row of content within the Google Sheet with whatever array that we have within the sheet content there within AppScript.